like 15 years ago. It was just this woman like spreading ass on a case in her apartment and just seeing like chocolate blowing off her sphincter. Hi there, kitty. Question. Question. No, you'd have me side by side with the news? That's probably not a good idea. <laughs> Wait, where's Katie so on YouTube? Um, are you doing like a massive, massive map? I uh, yeah, which is garbage, yeah, because I didn't win, it was garbage, just to state the fact. Yeah. Can do. Do just do stunt. Yeah, it was just way too sm Yeah. 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 Right, okay, so do standard and then put six city states in. Yeah, yeah. Gave her mo Did you give her money for the Jamaica deposit? Are you still going? Otherwise, she could have been the president. I don't give a fuck about sheriff. Money's money, bitch. Like, unless you're going with her, you are on some other shit if you gave her money for that. 
I can't even think about that. <laughs> I'll be fucking taking the wheels off the car and everything for me, dude. <laughs> yeah, you did, Katie. Her. So wait, what's going on with the trip then? What did you pay for? Also, what's up, Roto? The shot vac workout, man. <sighs> no, did not. Sitting on the couch, ignoring me. What's up, Sam? We paid half and half on the deposit. But like, are you going? We paid half. So who's going on this trip? Just you and her? Or is there other people in on this? Because if it's just you and her, you could at least have a good time, probably. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Have a slippery Play a little nipple. good cop, bad cop, steal the handcuffs. A slippery nipple. You know? All right. Inland sea, standard. Everything's standard. Uh, select natural wonders. Uh, everything standard. Balance, standard, standard. I fucking hate religion. I kind of want to take it out, but whatever. Here we go. Uh, limit turns by game speed. The game will end at 20... So I could just do no turn limit. We'll just turn it off. Turn it off, yeah. I'm be able to play until okay. it's over. No duplicatives. No dupe leaders. Um, I think this is it. Yeah. All right, confirm settings. Oh, this is gonna be a shitty mess. Let me DM you. You need toys nuts. Lane keeping adaptive crews crazy. I think he's literally a software upgrade from self driving. Yeah, it looks nice, I can tell you that. I'm jelly as shit. Wait. What? Is the X gay, Bob? I'm confused at that. Roto, I strongly, strongly suggest the tutorial. Our first game, we didn't even finish. It was a shitty mess because we skipped the tutorial. I ended up going and doing the tutorial afterwards because I was like, this is retarded. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I just cracked on because I knew most of it. And then the rest of it was big fails. Oh, wait, if we're leaving them city-states, I just turn these off, right? Uh, What? Cause these will be players. I I close these. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That way, it just gives us uh, city states. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I should have Sam. <laughs> Val, he's in a weird situation. I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> so, there's no intentions to do with or have any sort of fun with her. But I'm assuming you guys are probably sharing a room considering you guys reserved this. Like months ago it shouldn't take long roto i want to say it took me about an hour but definitely definitely not a game to just jump into and be like oh let me just go at it because it was you'll just lose a lot of stuff up yeah he'll you will lose. just lose um best thing you can do do the tutorial um and then if you want to play there, literally hits us up um, not to the point where I've Just got don't multiple play with JJ. games. He never shows up. Yeah, we do have multiple games going. Like so, Dude, he's gonna need a lot more than tequila. I 
Okay. Wonder how big this map is now. Hope it's bigger. Hope like we're fucking spread out a lot as well. I mean, I I I selected standard size. Yeah. Are you yeah. Search the technology tree for a new. Honestly, I feel like now, now that we've got like unlimited time, one of them we can chill. Reinforce. Yeah, I mean, I'm still kind of in the learning phase because I'm trying to search. What is this? If I do reinforce, is that bronze working? Allows chopping of reinforced. Reveals iron. <sighs> There's nothing that you can build that just harvests the re reinforced. You have to clear it. Yeah, yeah. Um, no, you get sawmills, sawmills that you can put in, in place of do the. Do sawmills uh, work on rainforest? I'm pretty sure they do. Type in. So when I type in rainforest in the search thing, all I get is bronze working. But let me do saw. Saw doesn't even show. I know it exists. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Maybe logging. It's got to be a different name for it or something. Yeah, just look for a fucking a wood. <laughs> a piece of wood on the fucking deck tree. Because you can do the improved encampment that does the um, sawmilling. I'm looking for it. Oh my. Let's see. Oh, it's it. under machinery. Yeah, lumber mill. Yeah. Buildability lumber mill. Uh, production is adjacent to mm. river. Production is fuel. Oh, wood. Right, okay. Doesn't work on rainforests, unfortunately. No, I, I was just going to say, I think you have to clear those. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> JG does cheat. Uh, it's not so much he cheats, it's just he withholds information. Yeah, that's the best way to put it. He doesn't cheat, he likes to withhold information. And then you find that information out after he's pushy shit in. That's just how it works. <sighs> I want to say I'm probably on the left side of the map somewhere. Uh, I don't know where I am. In a tiny little box. Oh, I think I'm on the far right. Yeah, because I can see the edge. Yeah, I can see the edge of the the paper, so. Which is good. If you're on one side and I'm on the other. Dude, I can't build on anything that I have. Fuck me. Just destroy the, um, the land, yo. Uh, you have to. You can't. You can't do that by default. You have to search up to I think irrigation. To be able. Yeah. To so get your tech up, and then you'll be able to build out. To me. Fuck. I only put my shit here because I thought it'd be good because I was next to a, a one tile lake for fresh water. Hmm. Not realizing that the other five tiles were fucking rainforests. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm on planes and shit, so. I hope my decision to just plop down immediately doesn't fuck me. Nah, because I got to do the same, so. No. <laughs> Roto, he probably does do that. He probably Googles e easy way to win Civ 6 and it comes up with be a religion cuck whore. Hmm. Be a penis. Uh huh. I can't do shit until, uh, do I have enough to buy? What was that? Tech boost. Technology. Ooh. Natural wonder discovered. Uh, I don't have what I need for this. Great barrier reef. Nice. That's cool. I think I had a brain fart. Ah. He farted, yo. Right, let's pull these boxes and get wrecked. Uh, 
Uh, you know what? I'm gonna change this up. Normally I go for like the plus one faith and plus one gold and all that stuff, but I'm gonna go for. <sighs> Why the fuck can't I build on the planes? I fucked something up. Yeah, uh, you probably need pottery and that crap. Like, that's why I grab the first three all the time. You know what I mean? Like, start from the bottom, get the first three, and then go after irrigation, uh, astrology, writing, archery, get all them done. And then I go into masonry and brickwork. Oh, it is. Fuck. I didn't realize that that was different. Um, yeah. All right, dude. I'm not gonna be able to build anything myself, so I only just built my first farm. I haven't built any Fucking yet. Turn ten. <laughs> built any? It doesn't matter though. Like unlimited time. We're fine. Don't worry. Let's just chill. That's true. Like, don't get, don't forget. Last last couple of times we've been on a time limit and we've been struggling to like get our tech up and other bits and bobs because we've been getting our shit pushed in by Bob's. You're not wrong. Welcome home, there, Bob. Ow. Roto, don't you even reference the news. It's fucking terrible and stupid. <laughs> uh, this is planes. <laughs> Probably gonna have to fucking demolish all the bloody um, bees around. Apparently, I'm going to have to do similar. Oh, What's up, dude. Zojin? Yeah, this is a new game. Echo won the first game that we had. Every game that JJ's been a part of, we've never finished. This is our second game between me and Echo. Oh, I'm sorry, our third. He won one. I won two. This Thanks, one dude. is a standard size map. So it's the largest one we've been on. And we set it up with uh, six other city-states. Ah, uh, basically just chilling. Wanted one where we could spread our legs and explore yeah, the end game. The, the turn limit for this one. Bob, I wish you the best of luck with that. Sort of. Warcraft is an RTS, real-time strategy. Civ is considered a grand strategy. So you take your turns individually. I mean, it's simultaneous, but like there's, there's rounds. It's not like you're just controlling the whole map, you know, mm -hmm. not giving a shit. Oh, always chasing the um, <laughs> chasing the dragon. <laughs> <laughs> who, Rudo, Who is it? I mean, you you'd think so, right, Bob? <coughs> uh, <clears throat> build more of those. You go explore. Ah, uh, so. One of them um, push fail shit in. When's your coffee beans around me, like? Yeah, I'm in the middle of like a shitty little 
fucking banana forest. Mm hmm. What did I get for discovering that tribe? Your knowledge of t sailing has advanced considerably. Uh, tribal village discovered. Okay. Right, Where'd they go? They just disappeared. <coughs> oh fuck! Did you run away? Uh oh. Fatal's being donkey punched by Bob's. He doesn't even realize it. Where? I don't know. I'm just making you exactly. paranoid. Yeah, I'm just making you Why paranoid. Why did you do that? Because it's really getting fun, isn't it? All right. <clears throat> One turn till mine is done, I'll be able to throw down. One, two... Pretty much. I mean, for domination it is. There's mul there's alternate win conditions in grand strategy games. There's usually economic victories, religious, scientific. Um, It's more than just combat. Yeah, you got um, sending people to the moon and stuff like that as well, and send the rockets and weapons of mass destruction and all sorts of shit like that. Uh, I built man, so I still don't know like what civic route I should really be focusing on normally. Mm hmm. There's just so many options. Ranking and support combat bonuses. <sighs> um, sure. Roto, I appreciate that. I don't know if I've seen her before or if she just has one of those faces because I don't recognize the name. Vincent, oh, Bob's up here. Vincent, what happened to that alarm? Hold it. I didn't hear an alarm, he says. <laughs> oh, this this wooded area is just so hard to like the plains areas. It's so hard to just I, it, I feel like where they started me was just like a super shitty spot. Yeah. Take these down. Bombs away from them. Ugh. Locations for structure. Fucking hell. What are you doing? Hope this isn't a bad idea to make town number two this far away away. Roto, enjoy my friend. Hey. Cuck whore barbs. <laughs> ho ho ho.
I mean, I got archers coming out next turn. Oh, yeah. God, fucking scout's ass. Need to get the bronze working as quick as possible. Well, I'm gonna die. Because I literally can't build anything on any of the, the town slots I've got. Any of them. Bob, I'm sorry. Bob, it could be worse. Just remember that. It could always be worse. You going back to Florida tomorrow? Is is it helping though, Val? That's the important question. Is it helping? I mean, that's what's important, right? Hey, what's up, Sai? You don't know. I don't know if you not knowing is a good thing or not. Wait, did I just take that over? Okay. Bronze working. Get that going right now. Zojin, that's amazing. Yeah. Oops, cyanide. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> I get for the what you say, bitch? <laughs> not, I said not. <laughs> what are you talking about? Okay, I can't build the campus on one of these because up the tree. Bro, fuck that. You need bronze weapons to be able to destroy them. Then you're gonna have to destroy all of them like I've got to. That's fucking dog shit. Yep. The show is. You duck. My dad. Make me my stepchild. Talking shit to someone? Like, everything you say goes from being funny to not funny when you can't spell it right. I yeah. will duck your dad and make you my stepchild. You know, it, it, like, it honestly also helps if they're still alive. <laughs> nah, in this case, fuck it, right? Like, you want to take that leap of faith? Go right ahead. I'll get you a shovel. Dig it yourself a hole. Show me where your commitment's at. Put her in the fucking concrete box. The, the autocorrect. Could you please wrap cyanide in cling film and kick her down a lay by? Thank you. <laughs> I hope this isn't a bad idea. I don't know you're messing with me. That's a great offense to her. Come on, please report her to Twitch. Hmm. Hashtag simp. <laughs> I really don't want to waste that, but... What do you identify as, Val? 
I hope that someday I'm someone's uncle. <laughs> now nah, I'm just playing. I hope my siblings never have kids. Don't get me wrong. Uh, I pretend to love them and all, but like, damn, it will be such a mess. Yeah. This is exactly the same with my sister, dude. It's going to get. It's going to be bad. It'll be like the worst fucking thing that could happen to my family if one of those Leonards is allowed to reproduce. Yeah. Yeah. Leaking in the gene pool. Have you ever seen a film called Idiocracy? Bro, that's my life. Yeah, yeah. Like, that, that's, that's, yeah. It's an echo simulator there. <laughs> I guess I can't build I can't even clear you need bronze working to be able to clear stuff did I get that yet where can I see government civics bronze right yeah if you go to your builder you hover over the clear Almost. it says you need bronze working you went to college at Costco you buy that shit in bulk He's a fair to idiocracy. Sam, I can't even tell you how glad I would be to be wrong if that were the case. It would honestly make me incredibly fucking happy. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's a one in a billion chance, and let's just say that they're negative a billion in that chance pill, you know? <coughs> I would love to be wrong in that scenario and they have like some fucking kind of brainchild. I would love to be wrong. Cause then I can have <laughs> like, I don't know, intelligent family. <laughs> this one scout. Your sister did reproduce twice. The world is no better for her having to spawn these creatures. <laughs> uh, that's funny. What is it, though? Is it? I mean, it's saddening for someone, mainly her, but also equally funny. <laughs> Dead. Hmm. Oh no, no 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 no! Why are you moving? Oh my fucking god! Shithead unit is fucking shithead. Mhm. Mm want him to attack the the fucking clubman. I didn't want him to move behind them. I haven't seen no Bob yet. I've got three, uh, four. Three visible, one hidden. Fuck balls. Oof, that bad, man? Hey. Kids aren't for everybody, right? Mm-hmm. It's okay. It's okay to say that. Unit's not going to be able to get out of here. Um, 
I know what that's like. I haven't seen eye to eye uh, my brothers probably ever. Mm hmm. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you're right, man. Ugh. Tribal village discovered. Go get him, shithead. Who am I waiting on? Oh, combat shit. Uh, oh, he didn't die. What a fucking champ. You are granted a recon unit. Yeah, where? Okay. Yeah, I'm on the, on the right hand oh, side of the map. Okay. There's an ocean right between us. That's good. Fuck out of here. I don't know how you survive without internet access literally everywhere. I need a drink. Mm -hmm. Fucking barbs. That's okay. Attack my little uh, scout. And you can't kill him, you shithead. Do you not manage it? Is it something that the landlord manages? Oh, my bad. I'm still stuck in this. Got me fourth city up, so. They won't come into the house. Do your thing, I'm gonna get me some water. Yeah. Oh, that stupid ass cat looks so cute. Yo, dead sky. Sorry, dude, I was distracted there. I was just, um, aching things. <laughs> How are you doing, bud? Hope you're doing well. Doing well. See you. This guy's gonna starve <laughs> until it expands uh, down here with farm London. The sucky. Chemo thing Chad, I'll be with you in one moment. Don't hate me. You hate you, fatal.
<coughs> Throw some production. Oh, I think that might reset though, because it's already scary. Uh, so you're up to uh, that guy, dude. How are your streams not go? But they're going well. You're doing well. And diamonds, man. One, two, three, three diamond patches. Got one up there. Damn, Daniel. Told tile producers war. Two production, two food, three gold. Damn. Damn. It's for food. I need to clear that and get that also. I need to land down here to grab. I'm liking the fact that I've got a big, big massive land mass life. Question is, those fail on the same land mass? <clears throat> you might open the window over here and let in some of this winter, do you? It's fucking hot. Oh. <laughs> That's cold. Just taking care of a couple of things. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, I'm back. Back? <clears throat> What's up, SK? Oh, you know what I noticed the last game that we played, Echo? I think I'm gonna try and have less cities, but make each one bigger. Uh-huh. It all depends on the amount of space you've got as well. Obviously, you don't want to like limit the growth for something. You know what I mean? Yeah. Give it like a good old space a Rooney, but it takes a while for it to get like not much space anyway. No way. Well, as long as it's that, got the way the cities expand, if you have too many and you start encroaching on each other, that's when you run out of space to build things. To keep those fuckers happy. Yeah, so you just gotta leave like pockets of space in that space in between for it to give it room to expand. Cause like the neighborhoods, right? Mm -hmm. The district, you can build multiples of those and just keep cranking your population up. Mm-hmm. Oh, that was the wrong thing. You didn't kill your scout. Oh, the scout got him. Whatever. Fuck the scout. Fuck the scout. Kid. Oh, I didn't build it there. Oh, you dickhead. I didn't realize he finished making his. Fucking asshole. Change the curl on this vape and it actually tastes like Uberdies now. Ugh what it's supposed to yeah yeah i had five thousand hits off of it and it was fucking tasting like caramel being caramel five thousand god damn <clears throat> mm -hmm. i get the most out of my coils dude then i respect that i was the same way when i still had mine yeah they're not they're not cheap man oh, no. gotta fucking Get your money's worth out of them, even if that means that you're suffering with flavor for a little bit. Yeah, so all I do, like, I build them in a line, like in a row. Yeah. 
Um, so they are kind of touching, but then they've got three sides to expand on. That makes sense. Yeah, as long as you have a direction to go in. And then, and then I'll leave like a gap, say, on like the one below, like a one gap, and then I'll build the city next to it, like I'm like close to it, kind of. But then that city's got places to expand anyway, so it doesn't matter too much. Just as long as it's got room to expand, that's all. Um, you're fine. Yeah, what do I want to go for now? Iron working. Iron. Scouts of barbarians, like at the bottom of, bottom of the map, bottom right hand corner of the map. <clears throat> That's all I'm seeing so yeah, far. Yeah, I'm clearing, clearing one camp out right now. It took me four archers to get it done. I haven't even got archers yet. I'm waiting. I didn't have much of a choice. Mm hmm. I did. Okay, I'd like to see you dance to each each of those songs in that playlist. <clears throat> no, I don't want to do that. I'm just going to wait till I get machinery. Wait a minute. Can you not go from left to right on the map if it's not ocean? Um, have you opened up the side of the map though? I'm at the left edge. Yeah, you're at the left edge, but have you opened up the right edge? You've got to open up both, both sides of the map to be able to do the left to right. Do you, re do you yeah. realize what you're saying? I mean, well, you've done saying. you've done that with boats. I mean, you're saying you have to open up the right side to get there from the left side. That doesn't make any sense. Right. So basically, if we if, had boats, we can just sail from left to right, right to left, regardless of exploration. That's how you explore. Unless, you know I'm like, if like if you pan your camera, you can go from left to right. This doesn't let you do that. Is it still grayed out on both sides of the map? It's not even gray. It's just that that blue background, like it just stops at the dotted line. Like it doesn't like do not pass go. That's it. Is it actually water over there though? Or is it a landmass? Um, well, no, this is the... Uh, uh, what's it called? Right, can you click with, like, a, a unit, say, and just, like... No. Click over no. there? Can't travel over there, though. Not nah, for... I mean, it's it's off the map. I can't... I... Hmm. No, Thanks. I'm I'm literally touching the edge. That's not opening up for future exploration. I just think that's interesting because I guess you can't go from left to right unless it's ocean. Because remember, we're playing the uh, the oceans in the middle map, whatever it's called, inner sea. Yeah. Oh, it might. Yeah, it might be because of the continent not being connected. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Isn't that kind of weird that they'll let it connect if it's ocean, but they <clears throat> won't let it connect if it's landmass? Yeah, but like. If they let it connect and it was landmass, then it'd be one supercontinent, if that makes sense. Because if there's no sea in between, then you wouldn't, like, you'd be able to literally just walk over to where I am. You know what I'm trying to say? I guess that's their way of separating people. On yeah, the so they're basically separated. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you kind of have to do that. Otherwise, it devalues having the sea in the middle. Yes, yes. 
Yeah. Sorry, I, I misunderstood what you said to begin. Fuck, I need to get uh I need to get a settlement towards the ocean. Mm-hmm. I've got three. You got three already? I'm seeing I've got four cities altogether. I've got three on the ocean. Close together. Tim and Kanye are getting divorced about goddamn time. <laughs> <clears throat> what happened? Did he fall out of fucking favor with the, um, the populist? He never swam in the pool. I hope is what he says when asked why. Yeah. Does anyone know what clip I'm talking about? No. What is it? The clouds dropped off. The what? The kind of divorce finally because the they clouds were dropped some off. Some kind of interview, and she and he said something about using their pool, and she goes. You know, I've I've never actually used our pool. Yeah. And, but did you know we don't have a jacuzzi? And he just looks at the camera and he's like, "Yeah, did you know we don't have a jacuzzi?" <laughs> <laughs> the way he said what though, when she said she's never swam in the pool, I could tell he was like ready to just fucking choke her to the floor. Yeah. A lot dog keep punch the bitch. It's like, "What?" Just a slow damp foot. Where you know. are these other city states? This I'm I must be on the bottom left corner. I found one. I found one already. But don't forget if your barbs are there, they're gonna be basically against me. She probably did. Mm-hmm. For aesthetic reasons. Not because she wants to swim in it, just so she can say, Look I at my pool. pool. I'd be in that motherfucker every day. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Years ago, when I lived with my father, there's a hot tub out on the deck. Big ass hot tub, fit like ten people type of shit. Yeah, I went in that motherfucker <clears throat> like four times a week, just floated. <laughs> just because it's good for my, it was good for my back to just like <clears throat> just get in that bitch and just float in some hot water. Yeah, yeah. But a pool, I mean, I love pools. I just don't like other people's pools. Like have like ghost I don't like pools. public pills. Uh, no. <clears throat> Literally swimming in other people's fucking piss. What are you doing? Please don't remind me. <laughs> Got a 60 swingers pub. Damn. I don't know if I'd call it that. I mean, he'd probably wish so. He mm. has a freak. Probably made plenty of donations himself in it, to be fair. I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> that literally would not surprise me at all. Open the tree buckets in there. <laughs> <laughs> I'd shut up. Come on, you can't, we, we, dude, remember, you can't say tree buckets in case he's watching. Hey, come on. It's gonna come out once in a while. I've not said it to him in months. And I just thought, okay, I'll break it up you just this once. No tree bucket. Okay, just this once. Him, if he's watching, he'll lose his fucking marbles. <laughs> he'll say it up in Discord, like, what the fuck are you saying? <laughs> fucking go on the dark web, start hiding the fucking assassin in there. <laughs> 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 Sorry, pops. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking water pail. He <laughs> just keeps it next to the tub. That's sick, man. What the fuck is wrong with you? Uh... <laughs> Where does it feel like jelly? <laughs> I need shit out here so that barbs don't fucking spawn. But I don't want to leave my archers because I'd like to use them. I need to get to the ocean. What a new settlement. An unmet player has finished building the World Wonder Hanging Gardens. Why are you such a bitch? That's you. 
Dans le rythme seulement. Oh no, what you're talking about. Mm. Mm. Just taught your son how to roll himself off the bed. Is your son a fucking turtle? <coughs> what? What does that even mean? <laughs> you raising TMNT? What does that mean over there? You taught him. You taught your son how to roll himself off the bed. <laughs> like a bunk bed? SK, I need more context. <laughs> <laughs> no idea. Are we talking are we talking like young young like baby young or are we talking like 13 year old then uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's on have, his yeah, back yeah. on his back kicking and fucking I scrambling see i immediately <laughs> assumed it was like a teenager I will fucking kill you. <laughs> Dinner time. Ding 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 ding. Uh... Alright. What's next? Very true. Mm. I'm wet. Need to find the ocean. Must find Nemo. Bro, I'm, so, I'm off to such a bad start this game. Yeah. Got there. This is the first game that putting down where my city started, I feel like, hurt me more than helped me. Yeah. Um. A whole lot of nothing. You go south far enough. A lot of fucking snow. No yeah. resources. No yeah, nothing. Yeah, same here. Same here. Big old peninsula of fucking coldness. Oh, we found Singapore. I have this lurking suspicion that I'm gonna I'm gonna have to put like scouts down there, otherwise I'm just gonna have barbs spawning in the fucking snow. Like do barbs spawn in snow? Yeah. Just the spot down below me, it's no, I've just left the belt. 
because we are, I have a city state right in between them and me, so hoping you'll right. deny them. I mean, they share that tile then? If that's. I will own this land. Oh, I want a thousand. Oh, it's lying to me. Oh, that's a wake up alarm. Do you have any coastal cities? <clears throat> Me? Yeah. Yeah, I have three. You got three coastal cities? Yes. Yeah, I feel like they just started me not fucking close to the ocean. Mm hmm. Probably started like deep, deep left. Yeah. Fuck. So I got three coastal cities and then one's in, inland, slightly inland. And that guy has a little lake next to it. Or fresh water. Dude, moving through these rainforests is <coughs> terrible. Yeah. You can get the movement buff, I believe. I can't remember if he said you're just through creating the units themselves. Good. 
I need to make it to the ocean with at least one city so I can send a trader to build a road. Yeah. Oh, there's. Oh no, that's not Bob's. Wait, one. to me. Where the keyboard software default. Hey, what's up, Wolf? Hey, thank you for the lurk. Much appreciated. Dude, that was nuts. Part of me wants to talk about it, and the other part is like, if I talk about it, I'm just gonna get fucking upset. Yeah. I know them feels. There was there was some like blatant and obviously fucking wrong things with that whole scenario. Like at this point, what can you do? You know, you can't really talk about it because if you talk about it, it brings in light to the fact that the, the chodes in it, you know? It's pretty sad. Mm -hmm. And then Sam's out saying healthy discussions and savage with it. It's like over here, it's exactly the same fucking scenario. We had that a couple of months back, you know what I mean? Yeah. I like that spot. That spot likes you as well. Yeah, I totally back that. If there's any politicians that were involved in that in any way, shape, or form, like that one dickhead that was like walking away from the whole thing, raising his fist, like, you know, like, you go, guy, like, what? How the fuck can you get behind that? Uh, give, it all, give it all of them. I totally agree with that. Uh, it's time we heard from Trump because his Twitter account was fucking locked for 12 hours. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker's got to go. People placating an asshole are just making things worse. Oh, it's right here's this. Uh... Send you over here. Well, yeah, there was people talking about why doesn't 
Pence just fucking invoke the 25th Amendment and be done with this bullshit. And like, why not? Just, just do it. Show's over. You guys fucked up in every way possible. It's only getting worse. Just fucking do it. Mm -hmm. Enough's enough, like. Yeah, like, it's... when is enough enough? Like, come on. It's gone from, like, trying to basically overturn a, a legitimate election to simply trying to overthrow the government and incite yeah, fucking that's what it martial into. law. That, that's yeah. what he's aiming for. Like, that, that's what he's aiming for. He's trying to turn it into a dictatorship. That's what he's trying to do. You know, so a press release tomorrow will be like, oh yeah, guys, uh, because of all the um, the bullshit, uh, we're going to incite martial law, and I'm going nowhere. Like, that's what it feels like he's trying to do. And he's doing as much as he can to destabilize the country as well before he hands it over, so he can go, look, I was right. You I know? was so happy. I, I forget who it was, but there was a couple of people that you know, were on TV that that weren't afraid to use Trump's name and were like, this is, you know, he incited this. This is his fault. Yeah. This would not have happened if he was not here today. Yeah. Like, case, they are totally right. Yeah. The problem with populism, populism and stuff like that in governments. I don't know, man. Oh. Yeah. That was surprising to see uh to see his VP not crawled up his fucking ass like a root. <clears throat> Well, didn't he already tell him to step down anyway and transition to power? Uh, I don't know if he told him that. I hope he did. I'm pretty sure he told him to transition to the new VP. Um, so Pence doesn't even give a fuck, like, you know what I mean? I think he's just trying to save face so he could go forward it again, you know what I mean? Maybe. That or part of the guy feels like his career, his is legacy over. was destroyed by being the shittiest president's VP ever. Yeah. I mean, it's not like that was his <clears throat> fault. Yeah. Oh, we have Warrior Wolven. Okay. I've got quite a little army. I do have getting them on my side. I'm going to reach around. It's ridiculous. It's the same over here, you know what I mean? Fucking a government that doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. That's all cloak and dagger bullshit right now. New government. Anything is better than the basic shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, sound wonder production. Great people. Uh... I mean, at the end of the day, it's all their own fault. You know what I mean? They backed the cunt. <laughs> like, they didn't have to back them. You know what I'm saying? None of them did. But they chose to. And now they're reaping the percussions, and now they're just like the full on scapegoating. It's like, come on, dude. Take some responsibility for your actions for being a stupid motherfucking chode. <clears throat> I 
Yeah, I, w I didn't follow the uh, the Georgia stuff. Like, I, I'll be honest, I try to stay away from politics as much as I can. Oh, you okay. uh, Yeah, I mean, a lot of it's just fucking upsetting. It's just you know, it it just brings me down. It it makes you blow boil as well, man. Makes you blow boil like. Lots of times I've sat there and what like tried to get into politics and that. And then the shit they're saying is just outrageous and you're just like you can tell that you were born with a silver spoon. You can't Yeah. You know what I mean? You can tell that you were born into a multi million dollar fucking pound family. I mean I think there's something flawed with the whole idea of a two party system in the first place. Definitely. That makes it sound like right and wrong because it's only two options. No, I mean, there's plenty of cases where one's right, one's wrong, or they're both wrong. You know, yeah. How often do they agree? I mean, you don't see that very often. But... Mm -hmm. And are often they disagree just for the sake of disagreeing as well. That feels like an all the time thing. Yeah, they 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 purposely go, oh no, we can't have that. <coughs> Shit, no. I don't know where to put uh, just because that's your idea, you can fuck off. Feels like a hell of a lot of infighting to the people who get fucking shafted to the people who fucking pay their wages. Right, so the we country. got Washington here, Cincinnati here. I'm gonna put them there because I don't want too many cities. I'll throw the one up here. Yeah. Ooh, arches. Name York. Yeah, you know. That's not a bad idea, Sam. Let second place be second place. Dude, can you imagine, though, if Trump won and Hillary was his number two? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. The fucking memes that oh. were online. Oh, the dude. Shit that would have happened. The way he, ch oh man, I would have loved when like <laughs> she was interviewed on. How do you feel about grab her by the pussy? I mm -hmm. would. Oh man, would have been yeah, like two would've... weeks into the presidency, and it would have been like Hillary Clinton arrested on suspicion of murder. Fucking self destruct. Yeah, fucking Hillary Clinton's pressed the red button and <laughs> blew the fucking country up. Okay, you know what though? By doing that, you might actually really promote uh clean campaigning against each other yeah because it's like well whoever wins we're gonna be working together let's not be assholes yeah let's actually not shaft each other and shaft the country along the yeah. way yeah exactly So do you specify that you're going to be like focus citizens on production to begin with or what you do? <clears throat> yeah, I usually give each city some kind of uh, goal. Yeah. I think that's what I was missing like last time around. Well, I was so slow off the mark. But this time, this time, baby. We are getting mm. all the districts up. Entertainment. We're yeah. getting... <laughs> they would have strangled each other to death in office. Yeah. <laughs> and nobody would have been surprised. Everybody would have been cheating. <clears throat> you know what they should do? I can like, hear Hillary now. I grabbed him by the dick and twisted. They, they should have like a trial by combat for the presidency. 
You know what I mean? Have them duke it out. You know. Fight for that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want, you want the presidency? Go and fucking beat the shit out of that woman over there. <laughs> uh, Specifically Hillary, okay? <laughs> Uh, income and switch ban. <laughs> you can't speak about Hillary. You can't speak about Hillary like that. What are you talking about, bro? Can't speak about women that way. That ain't no woman. That stopped being a woman in nineteen ninety. I mean, really, I think about how bad it would have been if she was his number two. I think about how bad it would have been it if she actually at the throat dude, every day. If she actually got into power, it would have been worse for you. Honestly, believe that. I think it would have been worse with her. As shitty yeah. as he is, uh, I think it would have been worse with her. You can write the ship after the four years. You know what I mean? You can write the ship and get there once you got rid of all these fanatics. With fucking Hillary, though, dude. Like, yeah, she would have gutted the country and fucking reamed a lot of years. Like, that, that's just how she is. She's gross person. That's all I'm going to say. I fucking despise that cunt. These all want to build on. And this is American politics. This is even English politics. Don't get me started on that shit. Jesus Christ. And European politics. Ugh. Even worse. Found the coast yet? Yeah, I'm about to put up one city by the coast. Nice. I'm about to get me fourth by the coast. <laughs> Sunk my battleship. Alright, so campers. Start coming down. We need aqueduct. God damn it. Stable barracks. Document. Uh, you know, other than the barbs from the beginning, the, I haven't really had them like going ape shit. No, like you got state cities around you as well. Don't forget. So they'll be doing a lot of um tanking for you for the time being. Oh, yeah, I've got queued. God damn it. Just bought the tile for no reason. Don't you ring the dinner bell at me, bitch. <clears throat> Unless you have cookies. My... Oh, there's a barb. Okay, hello. Old. <clears throat> My mom gets the uh, <clears throat> the thing unhooked tomorrow from her chemo. Yeah. Tomorrow's gonna be uh, I think her la it's gonna be the end of her last treatment. I think. Nice. She has to get a cat skin done and something else, and as long as that comes back good, <coughs> then be good. You know, fucking, we're good. Cancer nice. won't be a worry. Nice. At least not immediate. I mean, you know. Yeah. Moving forward in years, I think it's like every year or every six months or something. You still got to go and get a CAT scan and shit, but. Yeah. Build improvement colossal head? What the fuck? <sighs> colossal head is um, what I was using the other day. Um, what is that? It's basically like a faith 
slash holy site kind of thing. But it gives you like one food, it gives you like and it gives you gold, I believe. So uh, something to do with the interaction with one of the city states. So check your city states now, Ozzy. Build this out in a bit. Birmingham has been founded. All right. So you just have to wait. Another great person. I have a funny feeling this map is like pretty fucking big. Mm hmm. You ring the bell at me, kick. <laughs> Fuck, man. I totally forgot she had that in the morning. Yeah. <clears throat> so, either you stayed up or you gotta get off early, try to sleep. Um, I don't know. So, I'm thinking about right now. seen a barbarian literally wool, uh, woolen as archers swordsmen ready to go so i'm just like chilling building my city up i've got archers in each city and swordsmen in one of them so i can defend that's just what i'm doing just chilling i just found a little bunch of them actually Get the machine. Oh, three arches. Any more trade route capacity? Mm hmm. Special hub. 
requires a population of 10 or greater. Okay. Looks like I'm just waiting on that guy. God damn, Barb's leave my scout alone. <laughs> hey, sister, leave them Barb's alone. <laughs> oh, scouts. Huh? I buy right uh, by one night. Like to get a roll between fame and gun. <clears throat> oh, me scouts have found the barbarians. Oh no. Like right in the bottom corner. Slowly getting these districts up and running. Very slowly. Mm-hmm. <sighs> nice. Need to keep eye on food. I want to make sure I'm happy. One point. Ah, oh, that's built by the tree. Burp. They always overlook that, and there's so much money in that to be gained from it. Oops. I didn't, do you know what, right? I've been sitting there, haven't I, going, oh, yeah, the villain at the end of my turn, I can't do this, blah, 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 blah. I forgot that I could just click the orb and stop, stop it from then. Yeah. Singapore and fucking over Poland, sorry. And fucking more youth ever. They've literally got fucking armies upon armies. Yeah, Levent has got like way more than I do. Yeah, it's fucking stupid. <coughs> I wonder if they get hostile. I mean, I can see, do you know what I can see happening? I can see you getting one of them other admirals again and then pushing me shit in with that douchebag. Like, going over there, fucking impregnating the city, taking all the envoys, you know? Have you met more than one city state yet? Yeah, two. Singapore and um, Woolen. <clears throat> 
And they're doing a pretty bang up job of kill, kill, yeah, killing all the barbs for me. All I'm doing is building. Build, build, build. Just honestly, just focusing on just getting districts up. <clears throat> Nothing else. That's district, district, I'm district. Trying to. When I'm, when I'm starting a new city, just the basics. Nights, isn't it? Have you thought about going back to Warzone anytime soon as well, dude? I sort of want to, but it's uh, but we do it on Fridays, or at least yeah. that's what we're gonna try to do. We're gonna try and do those on Fridays. <clears throat> part of me wants to but at the same time it's so hard to grow playing a shooter as a streamer because mm -hmm. it's, it's just so fucking saturated it's so like even though i enjoy the game yeah uh it does shit for me analytics buttons i've heard that too i heard that the meta right now is just is uh, really, really awful no the the nerf <clears throat> the nerf and the dmr zone yeah that's what i've heard it's already got i've nerf. seen that specific phrase a lot I thought they got nerfed, the nerf in it. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it's Tim, Tim the Tatty, um, and basically. Tim the Tatty, the total chill. Tatty. Yeah, I didn't want to say fatty, you know what I mean? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, Sam's got a good point too. It's really hard to interact with chat playing a shooter. And like, I like interacting with chat. I like talking to you guys. I like discussing things. Yeah. Um, don't get me wrong, I love, I love a shooter. I was just curious. That's all. I feel like I have a hard time balancing them. I feel like it just does shit in my channel. No, I totally agree. I totally agree. Just thought that's I wish the it question. Didn't. Yeah, yeah. No, I totally agree. I feel like you'd have to be there day one. You know what I mean? I get lucky to be able to get anywhere Even with then... it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Get lucky. Yeah. The red shots. The red shots. I was playing Cold War earlier on, and the DMR is running rampant in normal, normal mode as well. That's normal multiplayer. This one dude, and I'm emptying a full clip into his head, and he's just like, be, be, be. Yeah, he's dead, dude. I've got one HP, but I'm alive. Yeah. I'm like, come on, dude. <laughs> yeah. Come on. By being good, you mean God. Like, those are the people that are, well... I mean, Tim got popular before he got there, because I think Tim is, like, not well, that good. Mm-hmm. But he was he was he was already big from Fortnite and Ninja and all that other shit before he got there. I know, boy. <clears throat> Dude, there's people that are Oh man, what's his name? One of the guys that I watched. Oh fuck, his name's Jimmy. What's the name of his channel? He was he was the leader in Fortnite. Like he was above Ninja. He was the first person to hit like a thousand wins, a million kills, all that shit. And like his channel didn't blow up. Like he's a partner, but he is nowhere near as big as his skill says he should be. Yeah. So even being number fucking one isn't really a guarantee to good viewership. Mm hmm. <sighs> Sucks. Doesn't yeah. help as well that the game itself and stuff like that's plagued with cheaters. And there's actually streamers who have been caught fucking cheating as well. That doesn't help. There's a lot of cheaters in that shit. There's people, like, it, it makes it look there's like if you see in somebody every game, though, man. Mode. Did you see the video I posted earlier? Uh, of Asmund Gold basically holding an in-game protest to all the botters and WoW? No. Oh, well, I saw you post it, of, but I didn't. The amount of people <clears throat> that partook in that and the volume of botters was insane. Like that's a that's an everybody problem, but that's like really bad with Blizzard right now too. Yeah. And that started with Diablo. They just don't fucking handle yeah. their shit. <laughs> RuneScape? You know RuneScape is like one of the only MMOs <sighs> I didn't play. Damn yeah.
Really? Which version? Is isn't there like old school and then there's like a 3D version and then there like there's like multiple versions of that shit. I love when like you don't know what the game is and you've never played and then somebody sits there and fucking uses abbreviations. It's like fucking typing in braille. You know how to type in braille? No. Oh. I know the abbreviations though. He's RS3 no, is RuneScape 3. RS is RuneScape. I never played it, but I I, I know the acronym that he's using. <laughs> I don't. I just RuneScape's one of them. I just never never touched. Never got it. Never tried, never learned. RuneScape is such a weird game because like it's been around for so long, but it has such a cult following. Mm -hmm. uh, there's nothing to build there. You're just gonna have to wait. I was actually watching a bunch of shit on MMOs earlier. Uh, out of everything that's supposed to be coming out this year, New World is probably my number two. Uh, Blue Protocol. It's going to be like a, an anime style MMO with action based combat. Mm -hmm. It just looks incredible. Like, I can't wait for that shit to come out. Which is weird that it's grown again. I'm very much so a gamer that likes to move forward in time. I don't like going backwards. Yeah. Going backwards. I have avoided going back to StarCraft. You know, it sucks that it burns a builder to clear a rainforest. It's kind of dog shit. The game's updating and creating new content. I mean, that's cool. That the community has that kind of say in it. Wait, where did those little assholes go? Uluru? Oh, I discovered a natural wonder. I did as well. You can't build that. Hey, what's up, Dan? I wonder if I can build that weird religion thing like on a lake tile because I can't do anything else there. Possibly. That's, I mean, unless you're going for a religious win, I don't know why you'd be building those. Other than on tiles that you can't put other shit. Hmm. You can't sleep. I hope I don't have that problem in a little while. I gotta take my mom to the hospital in the morning. It's her last day of chemo treatment and she's getting her stuff un unhooked. So it's gonna be a good day. Good morning. I just forgot about it. Oh, no. Should I build a harbor in my lake? <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's it's the end of his uh, six month treatment, and they said everything is looking good. Um, blood work looks good. She's got to do a cat scan and something else, and hopefully around end of February, beginning of March, 
her life will start going back to normal. Your mom is a breast cancer survivor? Good for her. Fuck cancer, dude. There needs to be more scientists working on that shit. More money. What um, build while I plus four point eight fucking gold right now. First break. Dude, bro, I'm six point eight. My shit ain't moving much either. It'll change. Buttons. A lot of people. Between cancer, diabetes, and heart attacks, my family is like, I feel like they're doomed. Same here. Same. Your granddad got his cancer. Yeah, my. Grandmother on my mom's side did. <clears throat> my aunt did. Heart attack for that uncle. Cancer for that aunt. And then on my father's side, both my both grandparents survived cancer once. My grandfather had prostate cancer. He still goes and gets his checkups and shit like that. I think it's like every six months or something. And then my grandmother on my father's side had uh, had originally survived breast cancer. Um, but we lost her a couple of months ago. But yeah, between fucking cancer, heart attacks, diabetes. It's fucking rampant, man. Dude, buttons. That sucks. That sounds like my fucking family, man. Like, they just can't seem to catch a break when it comes to that shit. Everybody who's out there in my family died from it. Dude, 20, 2020, I lost a lot of family, man. Yeah. <clears throat> my dad lost, like, fucking two or three cousins I lost. An uncle, another uncle, my mom's husband had a heart attack in the living room i had a heart attack in october grandmother passed away i mean the list goes on 2020 is just fucking ridiculous my god it's 2021 yeah man i spent like nine days in the hospital back at the end of october On top of already being fucking diabetic. But I mean, that's probably part of the cause, really. Strain on the heart. Don't do that. Heal. Barbarians approach. Pick them up. Fortify until heal. I'm glad I'm okay too. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. It was uh, it was a scare. I'm thankful to be here. I tell you what, though, fuck hospitals. Not a fan of that experience in any way, shape, or form. Gotten worse pre COVID, like. That's one of the reasons why I don't like going there because I've spent most of the time there visiting people who are like about to fucking die. Yep. Doesn't exactly make you want to go there. I think a lot of people associate hospitals with death rather than like help. Well, what the fuck was that? People need to invite their friends uh, to the hospital more when you have kids. 
That way people start associating hospitals more with birth than death. Yeah. I feel that Sam and buttons. That's why I. Uh, that that's mainly why my experience was so terrible. You know, you know, it was really weird when I was hospitalized. Um, obviously, I'm on a, I, they had me on a diabetic slash cardiac diet because I, I'm diabetic and I was in for my heart. They were having a really tough time getting my blood sugar down. My blood sugar was actually going up more there than it would be at home, um, mainly because the hospitals don't do uh oral medication so my fast acting and uh, my fast acting insulin had to be a shot not a big deal except their math on what the oral meds would translate into uh, as a shot just didn't make sense yeah and uh the fucking staff wouldn't listen to me yeah not not only did they not listen to me <clears throat> And I was like, look, I know you guys are supposed to be the professionals. This is your job. I'm basically a customer. And no employee wants any customer Someone wants to do job. telling them what to do. I, I get it. I respect it. I worked in retail a long time. But I was like, you need to listen to me. What you're doing isn't working. And all the proof that you need is in your charts. Because you have people recording things. Every every six hours, taking recording, vital blood work, the whole nine. You you guys are putting me through the ringer, so you guys should have all the math that you need to support my statement. And they're like, "Well, we can reach out to the the head endocrinologist, um, but until then, we need to do what we need to do." Okay, so fast forward like three days. That's how long it took for for them uh, to get back, and even then, that didn't do anything. Yeah. Um, and then. I started doing math on the the menu from the kitchen and it got to the point that uh, I started talking, you know, you, you call up, right? Cause like, that's how it works now. So you got to call up the cafeteria to order your food. And I was like, Hey, can, uh, like, are you in a rush or do you have a moment? And they're like, no, I got a minute. What's, what's up? What, you know, do you need help ordering? And I was like, I'm going to read off a bunch of things to you that I've been ordering. And I want you to tell me what your computer says the carb values are. Because what it's telling me doesn't match uh, the nutritional receipt. Everything you order comes with an itemized receipt that has an entire nutrition label packed onto it. Yeah. And I was like, so I'm ordering what you guys call... Um, they have a word for it, but what, like pretend it's a unit. One unit was rounded, mind you, rounded to 15 carbs. And their cardiac slash diabetic menu was allowing me seven units, which is fucking, it's over 60, which is what, you know, I uh, I would math out at home uh, when I, whenever I was mathing it out. Yeah. And uh, so they read me off their numbers and compare half of the things that we compared the numbers that i i had on paper did not match them yep the oversight the real bad oversight huge that fuck it up. huge 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 oversight oh well, they did it with me mom like they took her literally they took her off all medication so all insulin all fucking metformin everything and then they basically sat there and started feeding her just pure carbs no yeah not for I, diet I try, not to go, I try not to go over 60 a meal like three meals a day 60 60 60 and then a snack is usually around 20. 
I got back one of the, the itemized receipts for like the lunch or dinner that I ordered. And it was 115 grams of carbs. And I'm like, how the fuck is this, is this diabetic diet literally giving me twice what I should be ordering? Yeah. And I said to, I said to the, the one nurse that was, that I was trying to uh, talk to about how they were going about things wrong. And I was like, tell you what, I'm going to order a normal lunch. I'm going to keep the receipt and I'm, and I'm going to only eat half. And I bet you my blood sugar is going to go down for the first time. And like at this point, the first five days I was hospitalized. Yeah. She's like, yeah, it's a good idea. Let's give it a try. Kind of like, you know, just placating me, you know, just ringing me along. Like, oh, okay. Sure enough, that was the first day that when she came and checked my vitals, like six hours after eating, it was the first day my blood sugar went down and like dropped out of the 300s. Yeah. She didn't have shit to say other than like, sorry. Like, yeah. Well, oh, my right. bad. There's not much. So, so now she's acknowledging I was right. She changed her tune. She got really nice with me, but there's nothing we can do because the head endocrinologist is the one that makes up these rules. Yeah. What? <laughs> the fuck kind of nonsense is that? Yeah. Can you address this bitch and be like, hey, uh, maybe you were wrong? Or we did X, Y, and Z, and what do you know? His blood sugar is coming down for the first time in a week. Um, bone. Holy shit, buttons. Yeah, man, like, fuck. I get it. I know no employee wants a customer telling them, but like sometimes it fucking is what it is. And like, you gotta not be so thick headed and have so much pride that you can't see when you are wrong or something needs to be done, right? Yeah. <clears throat> like, I feel like that's the problem with yeah. like employees or staff everywhere. Yeah. Not just hospitals, stores, you fucking name it. I feel like there's just too much pride and instead of just focusing on what you should, the job, there's there's too much people that are like, no, I, I gotta be right. They have a stick up their ass with it as well. Yeah. Like you sit there and even you go. If, even if there's not a stick and they're not condescending, they got that secret pride. Like yeah. they have to be right. Yeah. yeah. You know? Ego comes into it. Yeah. And it's like, I will slap a bitch if you don't start looking after me and <laughs> listening, bitch. But yeah, like as I say, you did the same with my mother, dude. Like they left me with her with no meds whatsoever going into a system. You know what I mean? No insulin, no nothing. And the whole excuse was we oh, want yeah, a blood like sugar to get high. You and you, you, your mom's stats were equivalent to what I know is like four hundred milligrams. Yeah, which is literally half sack levels. Like how the? F and they're like, oh yeah, well let, let, let's just do this and we'll get back in two weeks. What? Would have been dead, dude. You what do you yeah the woman would be fucking dead you can't just not <clears throat> you can't just leave them hanging for fuck's sakes yeah so i had to get in contact with another team who overwrote that team and basically told them to go fuck themselves and took over the took over the whole system like and now they phone it on the regular and make sure that she's like within parameters you know what i mean oh man buttons that's fucking terrible <clears throat> Sam, that's a great way to put that. Problem is too many people care who is right instead of what is right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's spot on the problem. You know, like I couldn't be right about my, my diabetes. This nurse had to beat me. She wasn't diabetic and she didn't know shit about diabetes other than the instructions from the endocrinologist. And yeah, no by the sounds of it. to you, lady, but like I've been dealing with this shit for fucking years. And all you know is what you read off a piece of paper that someone else gave to you. And I think I might know a thing or two. And the fact that everybody's body reacts differently to the carbs. Everyone's body is Everybody different. produces slightly more you or slightly less like, like a Like a 20 unit shot of fast acting before a meal for your mother probably affects her numbers differently than that same 20, uh, 20 unit shot of fast acting before one of my meals. Yeah. Definitely. Not only that, what's in the meal? I mean, there's fa there's factors here, mm -hmm. right? Like there's there's things going on. That's like just 
it's environments as well like how, how active are you like what are you doing what are you how are you burning them like that sugar's off you know what i mean there's all that shit to take into account you know what i mean and they're just they're just not yeah and it was weird. Like as shit when she wouldn't listen to me she even knew me. she's like i'm not diabetic and i don't know anything other than what the endocrinologist leaves in the notes mm -hmm. i was like man that is that's frustrating yeah it's, it's that time where it's like okay let me just go and get this bath from me car um and i'll force you to give me the medication that you actually need i'll force you. listen okay when i have a hostage situation kappa dude but that's nuts man i wish you could have like fucking sued the first guy for negligence holy crap <laughs> farmers we know a thing or two because we've seen a thing or two basically like i'm not you know a physician i'm not a nurse i'm not a doctor i'm not an assistant but fuck I, i'm I've, i'm diabetic and i have been for years and I've, I've put in a lot of time into reading and understanding and to have someone who has no knowledge tell me oh wow you're right but we're gonna keep doing what we're doing because that's what she left in the notes that, <laughs> yeah like, Oh, that just fucking... A piece of paper overwrites your, your personal feelings and your fucking... How you are yeah, feeling and what data you're seeing yourself so is, like, retarded. Oh, sorry, I can't use that word on Twitter. Not bad. Boom. Wait, is that word banned now, too? Uh, I think it's, like... I don't know. Probably. Like... <laughs> buy a tile buy that because i need the food and then i don't have any money to buy these but i can buy i don't really like any of those i would love to get a campus up and going but i don't want to lose There we go, fuck it. Right there. I've got so much room, dude, that I'm not even worried. Yeah, I mean, I've got plenty of room, but for me, it's more like the the rate of growth and mm -hmm. like, oh God. Every single one of my cities. I wish builders could remove like a marsh or whatever without it having to be within your own territory. Yeah, yeah. Like, I can't build there, but I can at least fix the land. I wish late game you got, like, a, a specific unit that could just go around bulldozing everything. You know what I mean? Just make a, just sell a bulldozer. You know, yeah, just that. make a bulldozer. So we can go... And just... One thing, yeah, I'm focusing on this time, not with science. Dude, I'm trying to. I did good with that last game. I'm not so confident this game. Would you think that goddamn did about at me, boy? Well, fuck you up. <laughs> I mean, if it makes you feel better, Buttons, when I was in high school, I went in, uh, I went to trade school for welding. I couldn't even tell you how many times I almost died. It's why I got out of that field. I was the head of the department at Columbia University in New York City. Yeah, I mean, speaking of New York City, I mean, that's where I guess the main hospital is that my mother had to go to. What was it? Uh, Sloan Memorial Kettering. Wouldn't be okay. Wouldn't happen again. Fast forward five years. And your general practitioner is all worried. Once you get all kinds of tests, see what happened back then. Did not go back to that general practitioner. But the head of the Department of Columbia University said you'd be okay and it wouldn't happen again. And then fast forward five years and a general practitioner is worried and wants you to get all kinds of tests to see what happened back then. You know what that sounds like? Money. Mm -hmm. Insurance. Yeah. 
how much money can we squeeze from this pleb? That's basically what they think. The fact that you don't have your screen north facing is driving you nuts. What screen? This? Is it not north facing? How do you know that? Can you change it? Can I rotate this? How do you know it's not north facing? Wait, you're talking about because of the names of the cities? <laughs> Is that what you mean? That's I'm over here looking for a fucking compass. <laughs> I didn't name them, so... <laughs> you fucking ass. I'm over here panning around looking for a compass that has like, you know... I've just went into the menu. Like, what is he talking about? I've just went into the menu looking for a way to lock it to North Facing. <laughs> yeah, cunt. <laughs> nah, when you, make a, when you make a settler and uh, you tell them to settle, the game, like whatever nation you are, um, I think it just picks a name out of a hat. Yep. Other than your first city, like your first city as Teddy Roosevelt, U.S. is always Washington. But after that, um, I get uh, like, I yeah. can just get random stuff. I think you could change it if you wanted to. Or not. I guess it just is what it is. Well, I meant random as in what ones they pick in the order. Like yeah. I, you, you can't control the order, is, is what I meant. When you generate Things a city, like, uh, it sounds a random name. That's just how it works. The goal is to win, but it's not. It's not like combat is the only way to win. Um, early game, you're focusing very much so on building and your economy. Uh, as far as win conditions, you can win through science. You can launch a nuke, fuck everybody up. Mm -hmm. uh, you can win through religion, convert everyone. How do you win? Who are you fighting? So me and Echo. Uh, a funda me, me and Fatal are fundamentally doing a 1v1 right now. But then there's city states around the map that we can also take over. So I've got like a little passive kind of... Yeah. So we, um, we turned uh we turned the, the round limit off that way we're not limited by time. And it's me and him and right. six city states. Give me or two six seconds. AI. I'm gonna go and get a coffee. Yeah, go ahead, buddy. Get a coffee and pop me out of the mix. Um but there's diplomacy. Like a lot of options in diplomacy. Like you can set up trade routes. You can set up open borders. You can close your borders. You can be allies. You can turn vision on or off. Like, you can really control how you want to be allies if you want to at all. Uh, you can win through religion. You can win through science. Uh, what are the other conditions? So there's science, culture, religion, overall score, domination, which is combat. Um... I don't know how you win through culture. I'm still relatively new to the game. So I haven't tried for any win other than domination. I think religion is scummy. That's definitely a fucking JJ win condition. Because you don't even... You, when, when those little fucking whatever units start coming into people's cities, right? Like there's no warning. There's no There's no way to know. Like the one game that we got together, he's just sitting over there just f fucking converting all my towns and shit. Just pouring them in like rats and I couldn't tell. So relig winning through religion, uh, I think is scummy, but it's legitimate.
like when your city gets built they usually have a small footprint like new orleans is really small the number five next to it is uh your population so like through growing your population you start expanding you build different things um someone who's not focusing on a domination win might just focus on building walls to build their bolster their defenses and then they might not really focus on building units at all because everything takes turns time they might say f that i'm going to focus on whatever culture religion whatever their route is like i said i've only really focused on domination you know military might so far i have not really focused on any of the other routes Johannesburg this is this is the other city state it is complex uh this genre is uh I think this genre is referred to as grand strategy games so like if you think like Starcraft or Warcraft <sighs> that's an RTS a real-time strategy because there's no turns everything is just it's all combat and it's just go 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 uh, whereas games like this are considered grand strategy and you and your opponents take your turns simultaneously. Yeah. So basically a 4X. Um, Starcraft is more... Yeah, it's just all time. Spam button. You know what's weird about calling it a 4X? Really. Most people don't know what a 4X is unless they play them. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even remember what the four X's are. It's like explore. Fucking hell, I gotta look it up. Explore, expand, exploit, exterminate. Yeah. I was afraid to search four X. Um, yeah, I, I did it for you. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking so big. That one was gonna come up all sorts of weird furry porn and shit yeah some big chungus sitting there in a dog suit you know what i mean <laughs> some fucking fat guy in a bugs bunny costume yeah. wait how do you know about man. my how do you know about my other character yo <laughs> hashtag personas I'm just trying to be nice with this city states because that last game we played, I attacked them. Mm -hmm. Man, it took so much fucking time and energy mm -hmm. to beat up the city states. Mm -hmm. Oh, found like, no, I haven't found. Nah, I'll nah, wait until nah. I got fucking nukes or bombers before I try that again. Yeah, bombers are good. Bombers are really good. Like you'd think a row of five battleships on the coast would be like okay. And they, they did good with the one city-state, because I guess they were weaker, but the other two, they had taller walls, more or less. That was just not right how many shots that shit took. We need to get around the new TOS by having an emote of the main character from from tripping the rift. Oh, are you talking about... Are you referring to how PogChamps got removed from Twitch today? You guys saw that, right? It's not because the guy's account got banned. His account didn't even get banned. It's because of his face. They were like, we don't want, you know, such a popular emote being... <laughs> yeah. Because the guy whose face is, is PogChamp, uh, I guess, said some violent, encouraging things. Um, and Twitch was like, we don't want, you know, the face of violence to be the face of uh, blah, blah, bibbity, blah. Oh, some political bullshit. Yeah, yeah, totally political bullshit. I, I, all I could think was like, God damn, you really just take down PogChamp? Mm -hmm. Because what the guy said, like, no no one even knows who the fuck the guy is, probably. Yo. I've met a new city. I found all three of my cities. My end. I only found two. 
you uh, it's it, it feels like it's like an like a c shape the art like the islands were on make sense d no nah, i don't know what is it yeah what do you what do you mean by your statement with the new tos because there was are you are you referring to the other thing that was changed a couple of days ago where you're not allowed to say someone's channel is successful or has avoided being banned because of their sexual favors that they've like what the fuck's the statement let me find it hold on <laughs> on the rabbit hole we go complicated shit do, 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 do. down the rabbit hole we go <laughs> Uh, Where is it? I, I I gave someone a link to the picture in the TOS the other it's day. It's just full to... on shit mode. Where'd she go? Yeah, I'll I'll give you the YouTube video of the guy that I follow. This guy, his name is uh, it's a Gundam. Don't ask me how. But, like, every time the TOS is edited, he somehow knows, like, 10 minutes later. Okay, here it is. So, this one is common sense, right? Making derogatory statements about another person's perceived sexual practices or sexual morality. Um, that's, like, the politically correct version to really word... Um, like don't fuck with gay people or anyone in the LGBTQIA plus, um, which makes sense. Like who gives a shit who someone you don't know is fucking sucking fondling, whatever, who gives a shit? <clears throat> it's not you. Yeah. Who cares? Mm -hmm. to, and to put someone down for that is fucking stupid in the first place. So I totally agree with that. This is basically saying, mind your goddamn business. The other one, though, really weird. Suggesting, so this is against TOS, suggesting that a person's channel is only popular or has not been banned due to sexual favors. Yeah. yeah this is very important, that last part, sexual favors. So then you got to think to yourself, well, who could be receiving sexual favors for that to even matter? And why would they want to block that? Is it the person who wrote the TOS? <laughs> But that's a pseudo. I mean, that's that's a pseudo wording of yeah. uh, don't say this person is successful or not banned because they sucked or fucked someone at Twitch. Yeah, that's that's what that is. Yeah, why would that even be a thing? And like, I think it's wild that they have to give that concept any credit. Yeah, because like to me, that's nearly admitting guilt. Yep, but that's the way my mind works. Basically, you can't say things like they are still around due to wearing out knee pads. Yeah. <laughs> I found that way more funny than it should have been. <laughs> <laughs> See, all this is basically covered under the no harassment clause, and now they're basically sitting there and spe specifying what yeah. you can and can't Every, yeah, do. Yeah, everything comes. Yeah, it all comes down to harassment. But now people are like really nitpicking and getting super mm -hmm. specific, and you know, it goes, it goes. I think it goes way beyond harassment. When yeah, oh god, I mean, we're not gonna be allowed to say anything eventually. Gonna have to sit here quiet with fucking non DMC music on. Someone who knows a popular stream and offers them stuff to get them to promote their stream. Uh. No, because it says not banned, and the only people that could be doing the banning is Twitch staff. Mm -hmm. So the popular part might apply to another streamer, but the not banned part that applies to Twitch staff. Because nobody's doing any banning other than Twitch. Mm -hmm. On Twitch. Do you know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, the getting popular part, uh, you could say, is from a larger streamer. But the ban part, I mean, that's that's got to be their staff. That can't be anybody else.
Oh. Didn't realize you could put a lens on and actually sit there and focus on like your city and stuff. You, you know, you just made me think about though the whole thing where you can't say someone's popular due to whatever sexual reason. Didn't that guy Keemstar pretty much build his entire YouTube career on saying like, oh, these women fuck someone at this place. That's why their channel's popular. Yeah, pretty much. Because like everything I've ever seen out of that guy's channel, it was either like some kind of backwards racist shit mm. or uh, <clears throat> him just claiming, oh, well, this woman, this, this woman, that, it this doesn't... woman, that. Thing is, it doesn't affect him because he's on YouTube. <laughs> like... Oh yeah, he does a live stream every Obviously now and again. Rules, gonna, rules over here aren't gonna affect them there. But normally it trickles down, and you see like it trickles down to like fucking you. I'm more or less make, making light of the difference between Twitch and YouTube. Yeah. Twitch is gonna have a clause for like every single fucking word, and YouTube's probably like whatever, grow the fuck up. Yeah, pretty much. You don't like what someone says? Don't listen to him, dipshit. Exactly. Although I will say this, the streaming side of things is kind of young on YouTube, so you may end up seeing all this. Oh. Think so? Oh, I don't have enough money for that. <gasps> God damn it. Thousand. Fuck. Where can I get in roads in between all my cities now? Dude, I don't even know what I want to focus on right now. This builder's got one build. Let me build a builder, have him sit on standby. New Orleans. Just all a clusterfuck, like the amount of rules and leaks to fucking TOS that have come in on the back end of like people getting pissy over being called out. Whatever happened stupid. to the days of like blanket statements <clears throat> like don't be an asshole to other people and they won't be an asshole to you. Yeah. Like you can eliminate the whole big book of do's and don'ts with a simple statement like that, but goddamn people just fucking abuse shit. Fucks things up for everybody else. Oh, it's in that grey area. Get away with all sorts of carnage. That's what's happening. That's why they do it, I suppose. Political correctness was okay to stop the derogatory shit, but it's gone too far now. I'll agree with that. Like, if it's like, derogatory terms and stuff like that, yeah, I mean, but even that stuff still does fall under the blanket statement of don't be an asshole to others, yeah. and they won't be an asshole to you. You know? But obviously, I can see why there's a need for that because there's people that, like Echo said, they like to float that gray line, abuse wording, and that's how they sneak out of doing really cunty shit. But then there's people who just take offense to like the net, like to none. Uh, that, exactly. No then there's the opposite spectrum. They get fucking offended by you breathing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not short. I'm vertically challenged. Motherfucker, you're short. What is the big deal about the word? You're short. That's yeah. what short is. Short, not tall. Like, I can go into explanation here, but you really need it. Vertically challenged. Mm -hmm. Like, what? Vertically fucking... What kind of stupid statement is that? Like, what? Like, like what? what is someone... What, what, is, what am I going to say? I'm, uh... I don't know. I'm weight challenged? Like, I don't even know how I could word it. He called me fat. Motherfucker, I'm fat. Yeah. He ain't wrong. <laughs> exactly. It's, Tell him to it's come up with a better it's, joke. It's I'm correct. Like I bet you like donuts. All right. That shit hurts. Come yeah. up with something better. I'm gonna cry like a bitch. I'm not going to sit there and like, oh, he called me fat. I'm not fat. Mm -hmm. I have some of my thyroid. and Okay, I get it. You could have a legitimate reason. You're still fat. Yeah. I'm there too. Still look like a fucking whale. Just get over it. Mm hmm. Still look like a fucking whale, so you know. Like the male and female teachers who work together for 20 years. 
One day he came into work and she was dressed up really nice and he said, you look good today. She hit him with a sexual harassment and got him fired. Um, oh my God. Is this a real story? Please tell me you're just fucking making shit up over there. Like that. That's not. Is that sexual harassment? Giving somebody a compliment. How is a woman wearing a dress to work and the guy and the guy saying like, "Oh, you look nice today," different than when I go and get a shape up done, and like, I I shit you not. I mean, this is obviously pre COVID because this is back when I used to go to a barber. Um, one of my friends is a barber, and I'm I'm not even kidding you. The last time I went and saw him, and I got like a real good shape up done, squared me up super nice, fucking lines. He does a great fade. I, oh my god five or six women said something to me that day i don't remember what i was doing but i remember me and leanne we were driving around and we were doing shit we were running errands grocery shopping needed to go somewhere else and do some we were getting ready for some shit because i remember my son got a got a shape up too so what am i going to do i'm going to say to all those women like oh, sexual harassment because you know they said something at me one of the women was cat calling me at the barber shop because she was uh <laughs> the girlfriend of the barber and she was, you know, like when a construction worker does that, well, he's he's getting arrested. Well, what about the woman that was whistling at me in the barber shop? Yeah. <clears throat> Why is that different? What's up, Jiggle? Yeah, I, I don't think I don't think that sexual harassment should be that blurred of a gray line. That shit ain't right. It gets to the it point have, then. It should have a def. It should have a definition. Yeah. I mean, it's getting to the point now where if that's sexual harassment, then how the fuck are you meant to date? You know what I mean? Oh, for fuck's sake! Don't even bring that up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, you oh, you, you look fine you today. Look nice. Yeah. Like, but oh god! Like, what if she had perfume on? And the guy was like, "Wow, your perfume smells really good." You're not even talking about say. You're talking about the that perfume. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, doesn't that fall into the same category of saying, like, wow, you look really nice, you know, because they're dressed yeah. up and you say they look really nice. Doesn't that fall into the same category? Just like, oh, well, you smell really good. In some kind of way. I mean, no, that's sexual harassment, too. It's because of all these sexual harassment things that I don't leave the house. Yeah. Get too much yeah. trouble. Got to, it's got to the point now where, like, if you're not fucking full on beating them over the head and fucking dragging them into your man cave <laughs> and they get away that you're going to prison for sexual harassment now that may sound bad but honestly that is kind of like how it's fucking going it's like if you're not fucking sitting there and full on being a dirty horrible piece of shit cretin you're going to fucking <laughs> prison anyway <laughs> that, that's just the truth like uh... no matter what you do you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't aren't you I think that's one of those things that there there just shouldn't be a gray line. There should be a clear definition of of what is and what is acceptable and what is not acceptable. Yeah. You know, like if this guy lost his job over saying she looked good, I would have been fired for sexual harassment, 100%. Yeah. Honey. If this guy if this teacher tells another teacher she looks good because she's got she got dressed up. He got fired for sexual harassment. Do you think I would get fired for <laughs> sexual harassment? We're just talking about like the blade lines. Which is what was that? Yeah. You think I would get fired for sexual um, harassment? Like right now, what? like paying somebody a compliment within the hour is literally just as bad as you're basically <laughs> saying, "Oh, I jumped that." God damn, yeah. that's her opinion. Okay. When you're literally going, "Oh, you look nice today," man. In a way, you now least. exist only digitally. Wouldn't last two minutes before getting fired. Just saying, he's just literally just said that himself. I would say three definitions: physical comments and repeated interaction. Yeah, I mean, phys physical is like physical is crossing yeah, the line. I was gonna say that should be clear, but even that might not be clear. Found the faith. I don't have you any know? holy sites yet. So. Like if the like if if the male teacher uh grabs her by the wrist, is that sexual harassment or harassment? And should it, and should it be any type of harassment in the first place? Because the next question is like, were you hurt? What happened? Mm -hmm. Shouldn't like shouldn't the situation and its context 
be important to the claim? Shouldn't that shouldn't that be a thing? Shouldn't that be important? Yeah. I mean, that's another thing that's always lost in everything right now. Context. Oh, I yeah. I feel context, like context is just the out the window. Yeah. Doesn't matter what it is. Doesn't matter how it's said. Doesn't matter how it played out. It's just oh, right and wrong, and that just doesn't work. She gave me a whole hour. I know. I got a surprise too. I seen this thing on Instagram earlier. Well, some of you guys might have even seen it. Yeah, but that's the problem, Lou. Some like, guys on a plane paying somebody a compliment. Uh, he wants his window open, and, and then they really feel uncomfortable about that, and then they report you for sexual harassment, and that, that's what happens to a teacher, basically. Space, Worked together for twenty years. She dressed up one day. He basically went, "You look nice today." Sleep. Paid her a compliment. Got sacked. Um, instead of asking nicely saying. or or anything of the sort, like, she reaches into his. He's paying her a compliment. He's not harassing her. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And instead of being like, You're so if you feel days, uncomfortable with compliments, how are people blah, meant blah, to blah. know? You know what I'm he saying? just opens the window back up, and he's like, "Yo, this is my window. Don't touch it. I want my window open." Because everybody's like line of co um. Let me mute everybody's line for like comfortability or stuff's completely fucking different isn't it some people are comfortable with comp um, compliments some people aren't some people are blah 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 i want to look out the window and she's reaching now multiple times into his space swatting his hand down and shutting his window he reached his hand behind his seat right like a couple of inches he couldn't get very far because he was you know, stick his fucking arm backwards. She started crying bloody murder. This is my space. Don't come into my space. This is harassment. Don't touch me. That's sexual harassment. She just started going off. Mm -hmm. And like the guy just went quiet. Like he he was like, I don't feel like dealing with this shit. <laughs> it should, but is anymore like when you were a manager, the training was doesn't matter what happened or intent only what the person felt due to it yeah i mean that's that gray line shit like what actually happened in the context should be important yeah that's oh man it's not a thing jiggle that turned out to be so, oh thank god that would be fucking terrible Sue the guy that gives you CPR. Can you imagine Echo? Yeah, I can imagine it. I can really imagine it. What are you kissing me for, man? Well, you were about to die. Well, uh, discrimination. Uh, fucking this, that, this, that, the other. Uh, harassment. Uh, crayons. Oh, stop. Oh, I still need whatever that water shit water training shit is like i can honestly see that happening in the near future because that's how people are is the good samaritan law a thing he's too busy wanking off to an answer oh no it was me to some of the chat um because like, oh. they end up and basically said like i think it's where you are made to feel uncomfortable which just went over like over like everybody's uncomfortable at different points aren't they um, but as for CPR, like, yeah, I can see that happening. The way the world's going and the way people are, like, saving somebody's life is going to risk you more. Here's the thing with uncomfortable, though, right? <clears throat> Just different like, scales of it. In terms of, like, sexual harassment, uncomfortable. Something that needs to be noted there is, it, are, are we going to destroy someone's life over someone else being uncomfortable? Like this woman on the plane well, that's like, this well, is sexual harassment, your hand came near me. Uncomfortable is like, a broad way to use, even, though. You weren't even touched. The guy hasn't yeah. said a word. It's a broad you statement. Know, you can't just claim it because you want to. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's a broad, broad statement that can be used in many different scenarios. And there's different levels to the amount of uncomfortable you, you are, you know what I mean? Like, somebody could be uncomfortable with a compliment. Somebody could be uncomfortable with, say, you know, you've yeah, just like given them like a gift. Like, if the teacher lost his job because he said uh, she looked nice and yeah. her dress. Like, come the fuck on. You can't just take a compliment. It wasn't catcalling and whistling and telling you what he, you know, 
what he'd fucking do if he got the drink. No, he said, hey, that's a nice... You look nice today. Yeah. Like, what in the fuck is wrong with that? Exactly. And the people and the people that deemed him wrong for saying that. Yeah. I don't know, like, Karen, take the fucking compliment and shut up and go back to work. Mm-hmm. Exactly. It's it's one of them. It's a slippery road, isn't it, when it comes to it. Like, you just can't really fucking fathom what pe what's going on in people's heads these days. Fucked. Really is fucked. It's eventually going to be that way, Jiggle. Yeah, that's another thing too, right? They worked together 20 years. Where's the trust? Mm -hmm. No the, no friendship after 20 years? Like, that's wild. Yep. How much coal do I have? Not enough. Fuck me. Green gold. On gold. Maybe. I'm minus two on gold. Minus 0 0.2 gold right now. Dude, I feel I'm only plus eight, but I only have 48. I'm I have 97. Right I'm getting beamed by not having enough spots for the economy. <laughs> And everything's cost of maintenance, so I'm gonna have to dig some of this stuff and get builders out right now. Settle there. Uh, need to get trade routes up, man. Need. Hasn't you know? I'm pretty sure I I saw that in the news before. I would have to look up to see uh, if there was any cases that run by that definition, but I, I would not be surprised. I would actually be surprised if there wasn't a case of uh, of sexual harassment uh, within a married couple. Mm -hmm. And you got a crazy bitch who's just trying to basically pull the dragon name through the mud to get the divorce and not and run off with Tom Dick and Addy. I mean, I've seen that before. Yeah. That's just, Leanne, do you feel that I sexually harass you sometimes? Okay. What? She said all the time, but she's kidding. <laughs> she's kidding. Her. No joke, no joke. <laughs> please, please don't report me. <sighs> do you like it? Do you like it? <laughs> Can you name one instance for me? Can you name an instance for me? What? What? So you're just making it up? No, I disassociate. That's bullshit. You just got short-term memory loss, like a fucking goldfish. You can't think of one time. No. Not one. No. So then it didn't happen. <laughs> it didn't. If you can't think of one time, then it didn't happen. Give me an example. Yeah. Groping you while you sleep doesn't count. It does count. But you <laughs> like it. How do you know I'm sleeping? That's a good point. You make noises like you like it when you're asleep. Ah, she ain't got nothing to say to that, now does she? <laughs> what? I'm now a butt face. You take a stray bit of solid grease off the back of his shoulder. What, they flip out over that? Oh, God. That's dumb. Checking. I'd rather you pick up a piece of fucking grease off my back if I work in a kitchen with you and you're my coworker. Um.
Did me just have fucking grease on me? What the fuck? That's dumb. Uh huh. Oh, the bobs are coming. That's actually what I'm looking for right now, unsuccessfully. Mm -hmm. I'm honestly not even worried about them really. Uh, and fuck them up. Choose the research. A complete is the one thing. I mean, if you guys are doing putting it on as a in-house kitchen joke, then I, don't know, I mean, see stuff like that changes because you shouldn't be doing that. It's like when you draw a line. At that point, one day it's the back, next day. Yeah, yeah because one could make an argument. Uh, if that was intentional just to give someone else the opportunity to put hands on them because that's yeah. that's how that could be perceived immediately and you don't know what the other people are thinking you don't know whether they're basically they're thinking oh yeah let's fucking have a little grope don't like physical contacts where like you're gonna find a thing <laughs> Like, I'm all for joking around at work, but when it comes to, like, anything even remotely physical, that's when that line gets real thin real fast. Mm -hmm. These reinforcers are fucking me over. Once you get the roads, fine. <clears throat> what I'm talking about for building and sitting around them, I'm just because I'm essentially taking twice as many uh, twice as many turns because of the builders clearing. Well, you know, you don't you don't grab it off them either without saying, "Oh, you got oil on your back there," or grease, whatever. You know what I mean? Like just doing it. Like, yeah, you're warranted. Like, they, they're, they're allowed, honestly, they're allowed to bitch slap you as much as they want at that point. You know, because they don't know what you're doing, do they? They don't no, know why you're doing it. <clears throat> yeah, and did you tell them? Like, another thing. Oh, he did. All right. Yeah, he didn't even touch them. I mean, he was waiting for them to respond. Yeah. It's one of them. It's a dicey situation. Not even worth fucking getting into it, really, in work. I think I'm at the top of the map. No, 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 
pencil. Whore! You a contortionist? Yo, this map is weird as shit. There's no one but me. From the bottom left corner to the top left corner. Where's all these city-states? Uh, for me, there's one... Just like oh, mid they, they must all they rise. must all be around the ocean. No, they won't. Can't be. You don't think so? Maybe they are. I don't know. I I think they might be. Okay. Archers. Uh, I'm not sure what I just built. Uh, what can I actually build here? Nothing. Build builders for nothing. I mean, they're not bad to have on standby, right? I mean, I built them at my main city because it's quicker. But Bob's pushing one of me city. I was really ha I was really hoping that through exploring, I would find like. City states somewhere along the it's just me. I mean, I've found three I mean, so far on this continent. Is you possible that they're all over here with me? That would have to be really unlikely, though, right? Well, the way this is shaped, like the top caves around as well for me. Oh, big maybe. The top and bottom, like all the ways top and bottom, um, has a uh, has a lot of snow. So wait, was it okay when that person did it jiggle and just not you? Like No no attitude. I'll just beat it up. <laughs> I've just been like, you war. <laughs> now you got something to come like, complain about to you. I need gold, man. Somebody's in you. A gold. Gold. Oh yeah, stay the let me let me guess. Female too? Just taking a shot in the dark here. Uh sixteen year old female. And let me guess, the person who picked the person who picked it off them was uh either a better looking than you or b another female he's better looking than me honest answers only like say that that's the equivalent to saying no ugly people please <laughs> <laughs> but, man, you know the rules you can't be ugly and touching people mm. you consonant discovered oh Okay, I think the bottom New of the continent? map. Yeah, I think the bottom of the map is like split by mountains that we can't traverse, basically. Seventeen-year-old male was the other person. So, like, why was it okay for him to grab the bit of grease off a coworker from another coworker in a kitchen environment, but when you went to defense mode, was kicked in. Mm-hmm. Getting awkward, that is. Oh, there's Echo. Oh, you see me boat. 
Yeah, I got little fucking clubbers down there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. This 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 uh, that a map I think like blocked by mountain. I think there's a I think there's a one a one hex hole that you can get through. That's a yeah, that's all. Oh yeah, it's one. I might have to save it here in a minute. Hmm. I don't think me staying up through the night to take her in the morning is a very good idea. Okay. Not a problem. So you can't build a wonder when someone else has, is how that works? Mm-hmm. Fundamentally locks it. Right. I mean, four months, and they're still slacking in the kitchen. There's a lot of shit to do in the kitchen that you don't need experience to do to keep your ass busy so that the people that need to do the more important shit can get it done. Yep. You, I mean, you could do prep. There's so much prep that needs to be done in, in that environment. Go fucking prep. Go clean. Go get shit ready for whatever the person you know person's working on i mean generally you usually have like stations and shit if you're you're in the kitchen see i ate that like person they work registers <clears throat> so they're... what the fuck are they even doing near the kitchen yeah they work registers should be in the fucking dining hall cleaning tables and making sure everything's spot on they should not be in the kitchen is where they should be yeah <clears throat> Shit drives me fucking nuts, that does. Yo, what's your science production? 36. Alright, I'm not. Alright, mine's 44. I th what's your culture? Mine's 31.8. Uh, it's 25.7 right now. My faith is 188.6 total, but my income is 16. My gold income's down. Oh, uh, for two. Plus two. No, I was talking about faith. faith. Oh, faith. Mine's at plus. My gold is plus 1.5. One, 1. Yeah. I'm working on getting that up now. Take too long. How do I get this one? What am I missing for this? Change government. But I can't pick these two and I don't know why. I have to go monarchy. How does that work? Not sure. I think it's through the uh, that you picked before. I'd... Well, that makes sense. Or filling ice or something. It doesn't say like what I need to do to, to unlock these, but I don't know why I can't get it. I don't know, I'm just, I guess I'll just go with it and just assume it's better. Yeah.
plus 30% production toward encampment districts and buildings for that district. Oh, like only for that thing. I mean, I'm not really even coming across barbs at this point, so I feel like discipline's kind of a waste. Maybe plus one amenity for cities with a garrison unit. I mean, it could be any unit, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm missing something for it. Weird. Holly. Yeah, I feel that juggle. Policy research. Uh, civics. This. Not this. Not that. I don't think this. Civics. Okay. I haven't even established a faith yet or not, and so that's where my why my money's tanked. <clears throat> you can like levy the faith to be able to gain more Dude, revenue. Shit, I mean, I've got a little bit of faith coming in, but I still don't know how to do that. No, no, with the great person, like the great person, you oh, get okay. uh, the great prof profit. You can um, use that guy to levy the faith arena. And then you can do like plus amenities and gold and bits and bobs of them. Great person activated. Go, go, great a person. Go down, you dickhead. <laughs> really got into, like, fucking sending units about with, like... An escort now as well. Like a yeah. must now. Barbs are slowly starting to invade and that now as well. But we have units in place. And city state starting to move. Helps. Is there not a road there? Oh, there is a road there. Uh, we could probably use one going that way. New Orleans. Choose production.
Where do I take the least amount of loss by building this? Buying a tile, doing it there. Purchase who what? Man, I progressed from medieval to uh, Renaissance. Did I? Yes, you sure did. Alright, we have all the builders we could possibly need now. <clears throat> Great works, London. Beautiful. Okay, no. Useful. I feel like I should go up further with these guys. Towns and temples. Because <laughs> PogChamp got uh, removed from Twitch. You know all that shit that's going on in DC right now? Uh, well, apparently the guy who is the face of PogChamp said some things that were uh, interpreted as pro-violence or supporting violence and Twitch decided a few hours ago that they don't want anything to do with anyone who is in favor of what happened in DC yep. so they removed PogChamp from Twitch Nutty yeah kind of wild to think about wasn't PogChamp like the most used emote on Twitch something like that yeah I wonder if it'll still be on there was it chat stats it's just they'll be on the chat stats it just won't be yeah it's it's still on there PogChamp was uh the number fifth emote Jesus. it was used over 813 million times <laughs> It out. Sam, you have a wonderful night. Thank you for that. I'm probably going to be getting off here shortly, too. Because um, I have to drive in the morning, and I don't think I want to be groggy for that. Yeah, what is it, 1230 after uh after this round I'll save. <laughs> Rip Pog Champ forever will be missed. I'm curious if they're gonna pick another partner to do their own Pog Champ and just have that uploaded. <clears throat> Cause they were like, Yeah, we don't want to get rid of like what Pog Champ is. We just don't like this guy. Yeah. <laughs> So that's blocked up there. The block is blocked by mountains a little bit. Not nearly as bad as the south. Yeah. Which up top? Yeah. I haven't got what's up top yet. <laughs> I mean, the map's pretty goddamn big. Yeah, there's plenty of room. I can only imagine it's wider than it is taller. Yeah, it I definitely started is. started in the bottom <clears throat> left corner. And there's only one city state between me and the top left corner. 
Yeah. And they're just not that big. All right, next turn. <coughs> Things happen. This is where I save. I mean, Let's can I just kill these this. bobs first? <laughs> What's that? I've got a barb on one HP. I want to see if they run away or not. I'm a barb in a dream. You want me to save first? No, let me kill my asses and then um, okay. save. Just, just so it's done. Yeah, that's fine. Don't bother me. I can't do it yet. I need next turn to be able to do it. Oh, next turn. All right, well, let me take my turn then. So I can talk. Damn. Can't they move more? What did I get for finding them? Yeah, after this turn, I wanted to find find another city as well. So I didn't forget you, about you it. tell me when to save. I don't want to mess you up. All right, I'm ready. You good? Yeah, yeah I'm good. I'm good. One inner seas echo. Alrighty. Echo, I'm gonna assume you're staying on. Uh no, because I actually have to go and do some stuff. Um I'll be doing another stream later on now. Okay. Like I'm doing I'm gonna go down to the two streams today, like. Oh damn, but take a break in between. Get revalued by the hell, last two stuff. How the day works out for you. Yeah, I yeah. mean, the last couple of weeks, because I've been taking my mom to and from on Tuesdays and Thursdays, mm -hmm. um, is, is the reason I've been I've been getting off early. Yeah. On it oh, that's fine. Those days, but uh, like I'm having to do treatment. Yeah. Easy, dude. Like honestly, it's gonna be so much pressure off. Dude, I, I am so whole because like they've been saying her blood work and all that stuff's been coming back good for uh for some months. I'm just so hopeful nothing has changed. Things went according to expectations. Yeah. Tomorrow's the last time she gets, you know, the thing unhooked. She gets her CAT scan. All is good. She can have a port in her, uh, it's like her upper, like by her right shoulder removed. Yeah. You know, I'm just, I'm really hopeful for, you know. Okay. But, uh, chat, we're heading out of here. I think Echo is too. Yeah. I'm Are we going to hit somebody? No. Nope. All right. Oh. I mean, do you want to? I'm lazy. Oh, no, it's fine. Off. Fine. Um, so I'll, I'll be back for the second stream, guys, in about six, seven hours. Um, I'll do a midday-ish kind of stream. Um, probably hit up some No Man's Sky or Call of Duty, depending on how I feel. I appreciate you all. Shoot me, a, shoot me a message when you do that, because if, uh, if I'm up and on by then. Yeah, man, I will do. It might be when I get back from the hospital. Yeah, well, if, if you're back from the hospital and you want to play some Civ, then... Okay. All right, guys. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure that out. Oh, will catch us in a bit. Thank you for watching. You're amazing, peeps. Same, same, same. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye.